High school students from Edna Carr, Eleanor McMain, and McDonough 35 are saying enough. In fact, Inspire NOLA Charter Schools is hoping to expand the conversation on how New Orleans can combat violent crime in the city. Kenny, you were there and have more details on that. Well, as you know, Kurt, just yesterday there was a shooting where one student got shot at Booker T. Washington High School. And this just shows our kids aren't always safe, not even at school. But Inspire NOLA Charter Schools and McCarr, Eleanor McMain, and McDonough 35 are showing they want to do something about it. Today's students showed unity as they walked, held hands, and had a moment of silence for their friends and family members who have fallen victim to gun violence on our city streets. So I need parents to get involved. I don't need to see a plethora of parents when it's a party. Because we ain't going to have too many parties if we keep dying. We're not going to have a second line. We're not going to have Mardi Gras if it's completely unsafe to pump gas. Now, after the peace walk, students met in the gym for a presentation where local leaders asked students to stand up and raise their hand if they knew someone personally who was shot, a victim of gun violence. Almost every single student raised their hand. Many mentioned just how heartbreaking that was to see. Now, students said today that they are tired of going to funerals. They're tired of going to balloon, re balloon re releases. And they're tired of being worried over Christmas break that when they come back, their friends won't be in class. That's quite a statement. Yeah. Kids should not have to deal with that. Nobody, exactly. but especially kids. Yeah. Thanks, Kenny.